Okay, lovelies, here is the finale of the pop-up weekly video series that I've been doing as a result of some email system fuck-ups as a permanent, like as a great reminder, I should say, that fuck-ups can lead to more creativity and more success. So today I'm speaking to you about where you are focusing your energy and your brain, whatever you focus on, your brain's like the supercomputer, whatever it focuses on, whatever it focuses on, it just recreates over and over again. So if you find yourself stuck in a loop of um, failure or stuck in a loop of self-judgment and self-criticism or stuck in a loop of focusing what you don't do well, what you can't do well, what you are struggling with, then you know that that's just our brains working by design. You know firsthand what you focus on is going to be what creates your reality. So the truth is like all of us, I've spoken about this on a previous video this week, all of us fail, all of us fuck up. And like every, every person you look at has a pile of fuck ups all in their past, all the way there. And the only difference was there was a turning point for them where, and, and for me, I'll say, where I stopped letting my past fuck ups define me where I stopped looking at what hadn't gone right and started looking on where I wanted to go. Um, you guys may not know this, but I once invested $10,000 in Facebook ads to grow my business and got like zero return. I hired like a Facebook ads person that was like an expert and I didn't get those results. And if I would have continued to make decisions based off that, then I wouldn't have the business that I have now. Um, when we drop all of our past bullshit and all of those past stories and everything that we've like didn't work in the past and that time we really tried and that time we invested 10 fucking thousand dollars, which was a lot of fucking money. When we drop, or when we keep looking at all of that, we keep creating from like fear and scarcity and what's not working. And we like stop having fun and everything gets really heavy and really serious. And when we stop focusing there, we stop recreating this shit spot the shit spiral, the shit spiral, that's what I'm going to call it. And we like empty out our brain and clear it up. So it's much lighter. And then we get to focus our brain on where we want to go. And the more we focus our brain on where we want to go, the more we are going to get there. Like I think about it when my dad taught me how to play tennis and he would say like serving and he said, always look at where you want the ball to go. And my brain would always look at the net and I would keep hitting the net time and time again. And he knew that I was hitting the net without even watching me because we would be on the same team and doubles had live heart, get the best partner. Um, so he would, he would know what I was looking at and he would be able to train me based on where the ball went because literally where you focus is what you create. Um, so stop focusing on the net and start focusing on the point that you want to get to. This is how I became really good at serving in tennis. This is how I became really successful in my business. This is how I found love. This is like the, this is literally the secret. Um, and what I'm going to tell you is it may not be that the next thing that you do works or the thing after that, it may take three, five, or even 10 attempts, but do you not want to then get started on those fucking 10 attempts instead of focusing your brain on what isn't working. When you do this, you achieve more, you move quicker, you stop hustling, you like empty out your brain from all the bullshit, you start to have fun along the way, your brain is way more receptive to learning as you are going, so you get infinitely smarter. We just stop looking, as time hackers I should say, we stop looking at our past, we stop looking at what hasn't worked, we stop justifying all of our excuses, which is the video we spoke about previously, and we start focusing on where we are going, that's why we move towards it. Like your brain is literally this computer and where you focus your attention is the programming you are putting in. Let's focus your attention on where you want to go and you will move so much faster. And listen, you can keep looking at your past if you want, but that's like, you know what that's created for you because that's where you are now. Okay, so if you want to join Time Hackers, and if you join this week, you'll be like one of the first members, you will be a founding member, uh, then go to vickylouise.com forward slash group, you can find out more about it then. And I would love to be coaching you next week. Bye, lovely.